Zapato Power, Freddie Ramos Takes Off, Jacqueline Jules, Art by Miguel Benitez. Zoom, zoom, Zapato. One day, Freddie Ramos comes home from school and finds a strange box just for him. What's inside? Zapato Power, shoes that change Freddie's life by giving him super speed. But what will Freddy do with his fast new skills? Table of contents. One, a box changes my life. Two, I race the train. Three, the mysteries begin. Four, a pretty regular night for a superhero. Five, it's not easy to be a superhero at school. Six, poopy isn't good for Starwood Park. Seven, puppy is missing. Eight, I solve the final mystery. Chapter 1. A Box Changes My Life A box changed my life. It was sitting outside apartment 29G when I came home from Starwood Elementary. My name, Freddie Ramos, was written on it in big black letters. I'd never gotten a package like this. What did you get? A deep voice asked. I looked up to see Mr. Vaslov. He had a paintbrush in his hand. Mr. Vaslov takes care of Starwood Park apartments, and he is always fixing something. I don't know yet, I said. I can't open the box. It's taped like a mummy. I'll look in my tool shed, Mr. Vaslov said. I've got scissors there. I followed him with my mummy box. Be careful, he said as we walked. The paint is still wet. The tool shed looked bright, white, and all new. The last place Mom and I lived didn't have someone like Mr. Vaslov always trying to make things look nice. When big kids wrote bad words on the walls, the words stayed there a long time. Where did I put my scissors, Mr. Vaslov said. While Mr. Vaslov searched, I peeked in. I'd never seen inside the tool shed. There were tables and shelves full of wires, cables, batteries, and electronic stuff. Did you take apart a billion computers? I asked. No, Mr. Vesloff laughed. Only 50. Just as I was about to ask him why he was cutting up computers, Mr. Vesloff found his scissors. We opened the box. First, we saw lots of white packing popcorn. Then we saw a sheet of purple paper. It had five words printed on it. Zapato Power for Freddie Ramos. Zapato Power, Mr. Vasloff pushed his bushy gray hair away from his face. That sounds interesting. Yeah, I turned the purple paper over. Except, I'm not sure what it means. Zapato? Mr. Vasloff asked. Doesn't that mean shoe in Spanish? It sure does, but what kind of power is shoe power? I dug my hands back into the white packing. This time, I pulled out two purple sneakers with silver wings on the side. Exactly what I need! Uncle Jorge is the best! I figured it was Uncle Jorge in New York. No one else mailed me. Presents. I put down the sneakers and looked for a signed card in the packing popcorn. That's strange, I said. Uncle Jorge always sends funny cards with his gifts. Some of the popcorn spilled on the floor while I searched the box, but Mr. Vaslov didn't complain. Instead, he leaned down to pick up the purple sneakers. Nice, he said. A lot better than what you're wearing. We both looked at my shoes. They were all torn up. Maria from next door said they looked like a dog chewed them. My mom promised to buy me new ones as soon as she paid this month's bills. Now mom could use the money to buy something for herself. I had brand new purple sneakers with silver wings on the side.